can change applique options if you wish to change the behavior of the default options for applique. For example, if you always want to have control of where the frameout position is placed, then change it in options. Open options and go to the applique and punchwork tab. You have three options for the frameout. The default is place under cover stitches and the hoop will not move for the applique fabric to be placed. If manual is selected, the frameout position will be part of the digitizing process. If automatic is selected, the frameout position is determined automatically by the software. For this example, let's choose manual. You can also choose to have either single or multiple borders with the closed object applique tool. When single is selected, only a single applique object is created. When multiple is selected, you can create multiple applique borders. You would use this option when creating an object with a hole, such as this letter. I'll select the closed applique tool and notice the status bar is asking me to enter point one on boundary one. I'll digitize around the letter. and press enter to close the first shape. Now the software is asking me to enter point one on boundary two. So I'll digitize around the inside of the letter. Again, pressing enter to close the shape. Now the software is asking to enter point one on boundary three. I don't have a boundary three, so I press enter the software next asks for an entry point. I'll click to set my entry point and now an exit point. And now the software is asking to create a frame out position. I'll move away from the letter and digitize my frame out. You can see I have a placement line, a tack down and a cover. And if I select the applique and go to reshape, you'll see that my frame out position is exactly where I clicked.